Hi guys, it's been a while, hasn't it? I'm pretty sure you missed me. But what can I do? I'm a busy person. Popularity can be very hard sometimes. Stop pretending to be popular because you are not. And also, you are missing the whole point. It has been a while since we hadn't posted any videos because of our studies, not thanks to your popularity, Miss Popular. What's your problem? Wanna stir up a fight from the very beginning? Ask the troublemaker. <laughs> Anyways, today we're going to talk about the most wholesome anime series of the year, Spy Family that began just two months ago and fired up the anime community by its debut, surpassing Attack on Titan and becoming the most popular anime in spring 2022. With all of that, one could ask, what is its secret? We will try to answer that in this video. Spy Family is a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Tatsuya Engu. The originality of the plot attracted all of its fans. The story follows a spy who has to build a family to execute a mission. Not realizing that the girl he adopts as his daughter is a telepath, and the woman he agrees to be in marriage with is a skilled hitman. <laughs> what a family! In order to maintain peace between the rival nations of Westalis and Ostania, a Westalian agent codenamed Twilight is tasked with spying on Donovan Desmond leader of the National Unity Party within Ostania. However, due to Desmond being notoriously reclusive, the only way Twilight can get close to him is to enroll a child in the same private school as Desmond's son and pose as a fellow parent. To accomplish this and present the image of a happy family, he creates the alias of Lloyd Forter, adopts a young orphan girl named Anya, and marries a woman named Yor Briar. However, and benounce to him. Anya can read minds, and Yor is in fact a professional assassin. Neither Lloyd nor Yor are aware of each other's true identities, or that Anya knows their true proficients. The family later takes in a dog with precognitive abilities whom they name Bond. Despite these unknown factors and Twilight's occasional lapses of common sense due to years of being a spy, he must learn to play the role of the perfect father and husband in order to carry out his mission. Now, let's get to the characters without any delay. Lloyd Forger. Okay, he could be hella hot sometimes. <clears throat> An unnamed spy from West Dallas with extraordinary combat, memory, and information processing capabilities. As a master of disguise, he uses various names and faces for each mission, though he is generally known by his codename Twilight. Although he appears to be manipulative and pragmatic when accomplishing his missions, he reveals his soft side and shows himself to be a good person to his fake family. Formerly a war orphan, he becomes a spy to create a world where children don't need to cry. Your forger! Ultimately my favorite character in the series. <laughs> yeah, that's clear. Birds of a feather flock together anyway. Huh? What do you say? Um, nothing? Hmm, well it's no big deal. I'm gonna make you spit it out for me later anyways. What did you say? Your forger, a 27-year-old professional assassin nicknamed Thorn Princess, who disguised herself as an employee at Berlin City Hall. She agrees to a fake marriage without knowing Lloyd's true background because unmarried young women are suspected of being spies. She believes that Anya is Lloyd's biological daughter from a previous marriage. Yor is extremely strong and tough, as she can kick a speeding car, survive bullet wounds, and withstand lethal poisons. She is good at cleaning due to the nature of her assassination work, but she is not good with some other household chores. Her cooking is bad to the point of being poisonous, and while she strives to improve, Lloyd tends to do most of the cooking. In her assassinations, Yor is ferocious and intimidating, to the point of a bestial appearance. Apart from that, Yor is soft, caring, formally spoken and considerate to others. Anya Forger, the cutest jelly bean, I just want to squish her. A girl who can read minds. Anya is the only one who knows the overall situation of her family, but conceals her talents and her awareness 
both out of excitement over Lloyd's and Lloyd's jobs and for fear of abandonment. She claimed to be six when she read Lloyd's mind and learned that he needed a six-year-old for his mission, although she appeared to be around the age of four or five. Her true age is currently unknown. She was originally an experimental human test subject. The only confirmed detail about her past are her name, Anya, and that she had been adopted by several families, only to be returned to the orphanage each time. Due to her ability, Anya is not good with crowds, and because Anya has not received a proper education, she is not good at studying. She tends to read other people's minds for test answers. Anya's favorite food is peanuts. She likes the spy-themed cartoon Spy Wars and thinks anything involving secrets and missions is exciting. She is really flexible and quick-witted for a child her age. And from time to time, she is able to trick Lloyd. Damian Desmond, with whom some crazy fans started shipping with Anya, is a classmate of hers and the son of Donovan Desmond. Lloyd aims to approach his father through him. Since his father has overwhelming authority, Damien works hard to gain his father's attention and approval. He's diligent in his studies, and he excels in history subject. He was formerly hostile and arrogant towards Anya, but has gradually changed and developed feelings for her as a result of various misunderstandings during their encounters. He has an Imperial Scholar Order brother named Demetrius Desmond, and a German Shepherd dog named Max. How lucky! I want a dog as well! I'm not your dad to ask me that, and also, this is out of topic. <laughs> Becky Blackbell, another cute jelly bean and sweet young lady. Anya's best friend at school and a Cecil Hall's first grader. Her father is the CEO of Black Bell Heavy Industries and a major military manufacturer and is always doting on her, giving her anything she wishes. She is usually seen in the care of her butler. After Anya's altercation with Damian on the first day of school, Becky becomes Anya's friend. She has been treating her with great care, although every other classmate has shunned both of them. I don't consider Spy Family to be exceptional because it stands out as a masterpiece or mind-blowing, but rather because it pushes all the right buttons. Its over-the-top expectation about a spy, assassin, and a psychic living as a family caught us all off guard. Considering a proposal with a grenade pin to be one of many examples of the sheer amount of ridiculousness in the show, being able to handle a plot like this is what made it truly worth watching. While not being relatable to an extent, the characters feel real and go through emotional problems that we all can connect with. What does family really mean? What is really the true nature of the person you trust the most? Their likable personalities along with their mysterious backgrounds allow them to complement each other nicely, leading to interesting character dynamics. Overall, the characters are great, and this shines yet another spotlight into the show's potential. Even though the show is being done by the studio that brought us the tragic Wonder Egg priority and Attack on Titan, it also has a hand in the table. And it goes without saying that Wit Studio has been nothing short of a titan in terms of anime production. From the comic moments to the heartwarming ones, Spy Family intertwines the element that make up this show into one complete package that is perfectly balanced, as all things should be. This show truly does not disappoint.